fire signs hello hello this is your weekly check-in for anyone with aries leo sagittarius in their charts uh this is time stamped so check the comments below that'll be there i'm gonna pull some collective energy we'll do an oracle little peek in and then i'll do your individual check-ins okay um do check out your monthly videos uh i'm gonna be putting out a Lionsgate video for the 88 portal soon so keep your eyes open for that okay as always please feel free to like subscribe share all that good stuff okay if you guys want to book a reading with me you can email me at silhouette at gmail.com you guys may be going through an ending starting a new cycle though also comes with that right Let's see, some general energy, please, for fire signs this week. Destiny, we can't see. This is all, it's all part of the plan. But, like, also in the Joker's voice. <laughs> the devil in the reverse, interesting. Capricorn energy. Knight of Swords in the reverse. And the Hangman, Pisces energy. Okay. Um... Let's get some oracles. There's a general energy this week of changing your perspective on maybe how far you've actually come or maybe everything you've overcame. Maybe some of you are so used to operating in um, autopilot, fight or flight, survival mode that you don't even realize you broke free. Could have to do with love considering that the Ten of Cups and the Chariot is underneath there. Could be dealing with the Cancer. Regardless, let's pull a love oracle and then we'll get a soul message here. Uh, make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you feel guided to take. And then for our soul card, we have, oh, we got two. The mystic of divine love. This is, guys, love is divine and I'm nothing except love and mistress of the labyrinth. My soul knows the way and the only way out is through. Interesting. All right, all right, all right. So listen, there's this general energy within the collective right now, okay, of just what we saw in that shuffle, okay, the cycle, all right? There was one that ended, but there's new here, okay? You guys have obviously gone into this new cycle, but I think not giving yourselves enough credit. Changing our perspective on what this means. I'm excited to go deeper for all of you. Let's get into it, okay? Aries, you are up, my Aries babies. Hello, hello, hello. How are we? How are we? I am so excited to look into this for you, Aries. I want to know right away, okay, what you overcame, what you left behind, what you detached from. Something you were trying to manifest. Something you possibly could have had, too. Gemini Virgo energy. There's more Virgo energy with the Hermit in the reverse and the Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. You could have had it, but you knew it wasn't right, or you knew it wasn't stable, or you knew you weren't fully committed, developed into it. I don't even know what that would really mean. There was, yeah, it took you a lot to walk away. Perhaps it was something that was more forced or wasn't your decision, or maybe the divine had to give you some divine intervention to get this new cycle started. So that's why we're stuck on this. It feels like a loss and I want to run back to it right but it's actually a release and you are being propelled forward so let's take a look at this hangman what's the perspective for aries that they need to understand please spirit it's your energy at the bottom the fool in the reverse you've been held back a very long time because of old pain look at this could be a soulmate connection somebody from the past family members, friends, right? Somebody that we've known for a long time or have a soul tie with, but it became more like an anchor. No longer second guessing that you're not doing the wrong thing. That's what this is. It's like I always feel guilt or shame when I leave Six of Cups. Like I need to stay. I need to belong here. Hold on. There's something in my eye. I'm sorry. Yeah, see, look. The devil in the reverse again. Three of Cups. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, this could have been like a child, okay? A parent, again, a sibling, a friend, a soulmate. Where there is a very, very deep bond, but love isn't enough. It's become a burden. I can't live like this. Mm, okay. What is the best advice, please, divine? The divine knows your heart. The divine knows your intentions. What is the best advice for this week, please? Mm. Don't force anything. Six of swords in reverse. Don't run away from your problems, that's for sure. Okay. Don't be impulsive. Don't pull a, you know. Yep, six of wands in the reverse because you don't feel seen, valued, the connection, like something's going your favor. Don't run from that. Look into it. Look deeper, okay? It's interesting that make the effort is popping up here, okay? So if this is resonating for you guys on love, you may want to speak with your partner about how you're feeling. De your detachment may not be a relationship, but running, right? But Spirit's also acknowledging you to look at where you're stuck in life, where you allow your light to be dimmed, okay? Any last advice for Aries, please? New chapter is coming. Okay, you don't have to run. You go deeper and you find your new chapter there. There it goes. Knight of Swords. It opens up. It'll happen fast. It'll be clear path energy. Okay, but you have to go within to find that. Okay, mm -hmm. things are going to come up blocked for you until then. So don't be surprised. Okay, I hope that that helps Aries. All right, check your other placements. Um, yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe, etc. All right, Leo. Hi, Leo. Happy birthday. Happy Leo season. I hope my little lions babies are doing amazing. Are we making a choice? Uh, ooh, accepting an apology or offering someone an apology? We'll see. Tell me about this devil in the reverse energy for Leo, please. Something in your subconscious. You guys are letting it go. <gasps> it's for the highest good. Good for you. Libra energy here with justice. Okay. We know that it has to be done. Oh my gosh. Seven of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups in the reverse. There's no other choice. We gave something a very, very long time to work out. We gave it a fair shot is kind of what Spirit is saying. You're doing the right thing. You also um, may have done some healing work here. You guys are, this is commitment energy as well. Seven of Pentacles, Seven of Cups in the reverse. One option, long-term option, justice. Hmm. Some of you may be overcoming um, commitment issues, trust issues. Tell me about the hangman. Let's see the Three of Cups pop in. Let's see. Tell me about this hangman, please. It's Pisces energy. Knight of Wands in the reverse. The Knight, excuse me, the Page of Swords. Yeah, see, mm -hmm, Nine of Wands. You're comparing your situation, your feelings, your relationship to what society says or somebody, what you were conditioned to view. This is very much always searching for something else. when there's something that needs our focus. The divine says they've been sending you signs, but you've not been picking them up. You're just like, huh? What? What message from spirit? I didn't see that, <laughs> you know? Um, you need to connect with yourself more. Yep, rest. Take a break, okay? If and when things get overwhelming, just back up, back away from the situation, bird's eye view, okay, to gain some perspective. Any advice, please, for Leo, you know their heart, 
you know their desires what is the best course of action for leo for this week queen of cups operate from your heart space ace of swords in the reverse two of cups wow there's a truth you're not speaking about a deep love that you feel okay now this could be being present with it just for yourself or this could be sharing that with someone else opening up about it there could be something that you're keeping from a love as well that's coming in let's just look yeah you may hold like pain resentment or you may feel like if you told somebody something they would be upset okay like they're afraid to hurt someone um your advice is to hold back okay and just kind of focus on leaning in on your heart really be aware of how you're feeling what's in your cup and what do you want to provide okay i hope that helps leo feel free to check your other placements okay check your july reading as well august readings will be out soon oh i didn't mean to put these away silly all right last but not least sagittarius babies hello let's see what's coming at you with this you know it's interesting i accidentally put these back right beforehand and the devil was in the reverse <laughs> And the hangman is now in the reverse and the devil's upright. So I'm going to take this. That happened for a reason. You may need to change your perspective on something that you see as toxic that it's not or vice versa. Okay? Because you might be heading towards something that's toxic that you need to change your mind on. So hold on. Tell me about the devil and the knight of swords, please. Indecision. Should you? Should you not? Should you go down this way? Should you leave? Should you say something? I don't know. The world. I have to do things differently. Thinking you need to do something at all might be driving you nuts. Hold on. For Sagittarius. So. You're going forward telling yourself... Something's toxic. I don't like it. But Spirit's like, no, that you have to go through this. You have to see this. That is crazy. So let's clarify what you need to change your perspective on. Because I'm seeing it from your point of view as well. <laughs> like, you should be, you know, you're like, no, if I go this way, I need to be guarded. You know, but you're racing in. Two of, oh. Two of cups in the reverse. Temperance in the reverse. It's your energy, baby and justice in the reverse. Some of you may have went through a separation, a divorce, okay? A breakup with your person. And a lot of you may be moving on, feeling like it's not fair or it's not right, but it's exactly what's right. It's been revealed that something was not for you, okay? There wasn't fulfillment here. Um, not in alignment, no. And it was like unjust. It was like a pause. Oof. We need to look at how we lied or tried to force something as meant to be. That's what the devil is, okay? Because we have potential to do that again is what the divine is saying there, okay? Mm -hmm. Be very honest, open, clear communication. The Wheel of Fortune is trying to pop out here, yeah, okay? The High Priestess is right under it. The Tower is under that, wow. You know this change is necessary and that you need to break free from whatever this is or whoever this is. Okay. Advice, please. Advice for Sagittarius. You know their heart, their situation, their intentions, their soul path. What do they need to be aware of? Ace of Cups in the reverse. King of Pentacles in the reverse. You're drained. The well is dry, my friend. You can't give to this anymore. You were, there was nothing stable. This fell out for Leo as well, I believe it was. Okay, you need to take a step back from the situation, right? Take care of yourself. Rest, 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 rest. There's no foundation to stand on right now. That needs to be your focus, getting you okay, making you okay. Anything else, please, for Sagittarius?
Taurus energy here, okay? You could have that in your chart or be dealing with one, but this is about commitment, right? Knowing who you are, where you stand, what you value, what you need, and moving forward, okay? That's the lesson for you. I hope that helps, babies, all right? Check your other placements, like, share, subscribe, hit me up for a personal, and have a good day on purpose. Bye.